Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is Roberto Rodriguez, and this is Detail Culture. And today, I want to talk about the Buff and Bright for real uh, attachment. This is for pet hair. Um, I really do like this one a lot. The only downside about this: this is a brand new one, as you can see. It's got those little rubber teeth in there, and this is like an older one, the one that's been used up. The teeth wear out, and they're kind of expensive. I think it's like. 20 bucks or something like that but you can actually buy like a big pack of like i don't know i think i bought a pack of like 18 or uh something like that off the website and saved me some money so it only came down to like eight dollars a piece but they do wear out and you still have to buy them but they work very nice for pet hair um so definitely if you're using these you definitely have to charge a little extra if we can do your detail to make sure every time you um you know use one of these you get your money back from each time, you know, to be more profitable. So, let's get into the video how to remove pet hair. Alright, so this is what it comes with. Uh, I got my little box. I think, believe it's like 18 of them or something like that. Um, comes with a sticker. Comes with some of these. Use your QR code. Check out the video. It does come with an adapter um, for a certain type of vacuums. And then it comes with this right here and then obviously you know your little frill you just put this on here slide that in perfect and this you would just push that in here and then you can use your hose and hook it up in there so you can use it but for me I have difficult with one hand I have a rigid vacuum now it doesn't come with this I had to go buy this at Home Depot but you got to rigid it go in there and then you're ready to go now the reason why I like this a lot because it has its teeth and it can really get like the short pet hair or like some dirt um, kind of in the carpets that are not embedded too badly um, this is another option for pet hair removal um, this one right here it's good for like long dog hairs. If you have any short dog hairs, this is probably not the one for you. I always kind of struggle with that. Um, and there's another one, uh, carpet brush. I'll show you right there. A picture. I don't have one, but they seem to be pretty good. A lot of people use them. So, but yeah, this is all what it comes with. So that's it. I know this isn't a lot of dog hair, but for the purpose of the video, this is what I'm working with. I just want to show you an example of how to use this. You don't want to put too much pressure down either. You don't want to put, um, push the dog hair further in the fibers. Just some light pressure is really all you need. It should be okay. And with this, you can probably do two to three vehicles before um, the teeth kind of wear out on it. So definitely keep that in mind when you're doing this. And also, when you put this on the vacuum, it is kind of screechy. So it is loud, um, in my opinion. Um, so definitely wear some ear protection if you want to. Me, I like to detail with my uh, my Bose earbuds. So I'm normally pretty good. But it does a phenomenal job. This is the tool I like to use. Just to get it all the hair out of there and then suck it up at the same time all right you can see how easily it, it removed the pet hair without actually keep on going back and forth with it and just staying there it pretty much once it hit the pet hair it always moved and sucked it up so it's a uh, very nice I, I really love the tool um, the reason why I bought it because I was doing like a back of SUV back in this spot and uh, I just I just couldn't get it out it just bugged me so much I had to tell the customer I, I tried everything and it wasn't working for me so I did some more research and uh, that's what I found and picked them up and everyone and didn't go back so I definitely love it and they're really good for like uh, seats like this everyone knows we can get pet hair and all that stuff it's a pain in the ass to get uh, stuff out of there so uh, that should be the end of the video I hope you all enjoy it and hopefully it helps you all out all right catch you on the next one